Christina with Parish Learning Zone. In this video series, I will answer one of the most common questions that we get asked at Parish Learning Zone by both students and parents. When should I take the SAT? There are five main factors to consider when answering this question and before you make a decision about when to take your SAT test. We talked about when will you need the scores, what does your schedule look like, when will you be ready academically, how much improvement is needed, and today we'll talk about how will you prepare for the test. Ask yourself whether you'll have the self-discipline and knowledge to prepare on your own. Some students who are highly self-motivated and know the content are able to practice timing, strategies, and SAT questions on their own to prepare for their SAT. Other students benefit from having dedicated and scheduled time to work with a tutor and prepare for the SAT and from having a teacher that can help them to work through difficult problems and teach or reteach concepts that they are unfamiliar with. Think about what you're able to do on your own and what you might need help with. Then plan ahead so that you'll have time to get help that you need before your test. Parish Learning Zone offers individual SAT prep and small groups for students who plan to take the SAT in the next year. We also offer an SAT workshop for freshmen and sophomores who would like to familiarize themselves with the SAT but aren't quite ready to take the test yet. Even students who are working with a tutor will need to spend time outside their sessions practicing. The good news is that there are many free ways to practice for the SAT. Students should link their PSAT scores to the Khan Academy. This will customize any future practice that they do. The Khan Academy provides free practice and videos, as well as diagnostic tests if you have not yet taken the PSAT to help students prepare on their own for the SAT. The College Board also offers a great app where students can answer a question each day to help prepare over time. And the College Board also has many free practice tests with an instant scoring app. The links to these free practice applications can be found in the blog that is attached to this video series. Thank you for watching this five-part video series to answer the question, when should I take the SAT?